Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Mike. In this video, I am continuing my iOS 8 coverage and I am going over iOS 8 quick reply feature. So I'm gonna send myself a message right here and it will come in as a banner, but you can do more than just swiping up to dismiss it. If you swipe down on it, it will give you this new option to do a quick reply. Now, obviously, you can type in your reply in the new iOS 8 keyboard with predictive text above it, but it does not stop there. You can also send a voice message. All you have to do is hold that little microphone button to the right of the text input area, say whatever you want to say and release when you're done, and then you can tap the send button to send it to the recipient. So right now, I'm just going to type in a message. I am texting myself, so it is going to come back to me. I'm just going to type in hi and hit the send button. It will take me back to the home screen. And because I am texting myself, it will come in as a banner on my phone. And again, instead of swiping up to dismiss it or tapping on it to open the messages app, you can swipe down and you can enter in your reply. You can do a voice message and so forth. So to conclude, the quick reply feature in iOS 8 is probably my favorite feature that was introduced with this software upgrade. It makes replying to iMessages and text messages much quicker, and along with the voice reply feature, it makes messaging on your iPhone the best it has ever been. So hopefully you guys enjoyed my review of the iOS 8 quick reply feature. If you did and want to see more, make sure to subscribe to this channel so you stay up to date with all the iOS 8 coverage. Thank you guys for watching. My name is Mike, and I'll see you in the next video.